Hello, this is NY Hunter again, and I thought I'd do something uh, different today because I picked up this flashlight, this keychain flashlight that I thought would help um, whenever things get lost in the car, out back, um, just anywhere that's dark. And um, yeah, I, let me show it to you. Uh, what is it called? It is called the Night Core 500. Um, or maybe it's just 500 lumens and it's a Night Core. Um, but it's actually called the Tinny 2 uh, Dual Core Intelligent Keychain Light. Uh, it is USB-C, so that's awesome. It charges quickly. Um, there's a couple different modes and a nice on and off switch. Uh, let me see. Over here, gives you some more data on what it is. Waterproof IP54 impact resistance, max intensity, max distance, and once again, 500 lumens. Pretty good, pretty cool. Let's look at the back. Um, some more features right here, uh, basically the same. Uh, let's see, in case anyone needs it, I don't know what the QR code is for, but maybe it's the same as their company one right here. I'll put a picture of this at the end also. I uh, haven't used it, but it does is supposed to lead you to them on Facebook. I found my Nightcore on Amazon, actually, when I was looking for flashlights. Um, and coincidentally, there is someone I follow on YouTube, Mark Young, who is a... Um, a more regular reviewer of all this kind of outdoorsy stuff um, and then uh, gadget stuff. And um, his... A uh, recent review on a night core light is really awesome as well. So take a look at his uh, his uh, channel. Uh, let's see. This is just a plastic. They came inside. Um, instructions here. Um, pretty big. I'm not gonna. Oh well, there's different languages too, but I'm not gonna show you all of it here. But basically, that comes in the package, and then this little cool troubleshooting paper because um it actually comes locked in um let me see oh actually it's not here you have to look at the instructions for it but um it does come locked in lock number two mode which is um uh, let's see well <laughs> it was hard to unlock i'll give you that and i think uh it had to do with uh, hitting the power button once or twice and holding down and then um, it unlocked fully or maybe it was the menu I'll get that cleared up but it was the menu and then holding the power and that unlocked it from the uh, the level two lock mode but this is actually right now locked in level one uh, you'll see when I press oh actually it's not locked at all <laughs> but um, you can hold it down when you turn it off and now it's in level one lock mode, so it doesn't turn on automatically in your pocket. And what you do to turn it back on is you press once and you hold the second time and it unlocks. We can see that here. And now it's on. The last, it, it will turn on in the um, last saved mode you were in. So I was at 200 uh, lumens, but then again, there's a couple of different modes. I can press it here uh, actually, it tells you in level one is what it is now, and you have 60 hours of power. Um, let's see, 15, oh, this is level two. Uh, yeah, 15 lumens, and gives you seven hours and 47 minutes. Um, yep, and then 65 lumens. I don't know what they use to gauge what were good levels, but that's two hours and 28 minutes. And then the 200 lumen max, which is about 45 minutes, uh, level four. And um, they have a turbo mode, too, that I think is only supposed to last. Uh, well, let's see. If you hold down the menu button, uh, or what I call the menu button here, the hamburger button, um, you will see it go into turbo mode. And then let's see how long it lasts. Yeah, turbo, 15 minutes, but that is super bright, and I'll demonstrate that later. And then as soon as you let go, it goes back to 200. Uh, but yeah, we'll turn it off for now um, and just examine it a little bit better. You'll see two LEDs there, um, really bright, like I said, and then the name and the model in Nightcore Tinny 2, serial number. And then here's where the USB-C plug is. 
so I've never needed to charge it yet, but I suspect very fast charging, and I think the instructions said a little over an hour. Um, let's see. Yeah, and then finally, so it's really small too, by the way. I'm a Transformers reviewer, really, but you'll see this Iron Factory uh, Beachcomber for those that know him, and it's smaller than he is, so pretty cool, pretty cool. And then, um, oh, this is probably a better gauge for those who know the Apple uh, mouse uh, or trackpad. It's about that big, so pretty small indeed. And light. Okay, and now let's see. This is the last thing I want to show you from the packaging. They have a series, Nightcore Keychain Light Series. And um, yeah, I believe, let's see. Yeah, I believe Mark Young, he, uh, he reviewed the Tup. Yeah, this one, the Tup. And uh, yeah, go, go take a look at his uh, review as well. I'm going to link you to it at the bottom of the uh, description of this video. Uh, really good stuff he has and does. And then the back of the card or the soft card here. Um, but anyway, yeah, let me go just remind myself what level two was. I'll tell you about that. And then that's the way the flashlight comes in. So hopefully that will help somebody in the future when they get it, if you know what it is. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we'll do a little test in here, in my basement of the light. All right, be right back. Okay, back again to share this with you. Uh, basically in the instruction booklet, you can see here, um, so yeah, it comes in full lockout mode, number two, and uh, you just basically do the same thing to unlock where you press the power button and hold the power button and it should unlock. So whether that is level one or level two, uh, it will unlock the mode. And that's good to know because when you receive it, it's in level two. And like I said, I was a little confused until I saw this page or this part of the instructions on how to unlock it. Uh, and then once again, to lock it, in level one, you just, um, as you're turning it off, you keep this button down and it locks. And then if you want to lock it in full lockout level two, then you can just hold on to it even longer. And uh, let's, let's demo that right now. So basically it's not locked at all right now, so it'll turn on. And then I'll, I guess I'll hold it down and then we'll see it lock into level one. And I'll keep the button down and let's see if it locks into level two. Here we go. Oh, one. Oh yeah, now it's locked out level two. So n nothing should turn it on or it's a, you know, it's a safety feature when it's in your pocket or hanging from your belt or what have you, it should not turn on. But then if you want to unlock it, press and hold and it should unlock. Oh yeah, there it goes. So very good. I usually use lockout level one, which is just hold and see the one and that's it. All right, so now let's uh, turn off all the lights, do a little testing, and uh, just see the difference in lighting. All right, be right back. Okay, I'm back. It's not fully darkened yet. Um, my monitors are still shutting themselves down. I wanted to make it darker, but I can't wait forever. Um, in any case, we, um, I wanted to show you what uh, the first level looks like. Here we go. Uh, it's here. And this is the first level, which is one lumen. If you can see Optimus Prime over there and some toys over here, some more figures, I mean. And uh, yeah, that is about how uh, bright one lumen is. All right, we'll go to the next one. Let me bring it closer to myself so I can see what the setting was. Um, and then it is 15 lumens. So that is 15 lumens. Pretty good, right? Okay, and then we're gonna go to 65 lumens. Everything's basically very clear there and you have over two hours of power right there. So let's see, finally, I think that's the next level and that is 200 lumens. So yeah, and it's really bright. You can see just about everything. So um, pretty cool, huh? All right, let me shut this down. Back to one lumen, which is pretty, pretty good 
for a dark darker standard actually so all right hope this helps um i'll be right back with some final thoughts okay i'm back i hope that demo helped out just a bit um it wasn't really pitch black here so uh you know um but it is you know even at one lumen it was pretty nicely lit as far as the room around here so uh pretty cool i would say i'm really happy with it um i'm looking forward for to, for it to help me find lost items and uh see outside when i need it uh like i said very light very good use i think or it will be and then this is the series once again should you need to know the different models and then here's the link again to their facebook all right and um yeah this is just my product that i bought i'm going to keep and uh yeah i did not need to uh i didn't was not sponsoring or sponsored in any way and um yeah it's just something i really liked after i opened it up and tried it so uh, that's it for now this is ny hunter and um if you like this video please thumbs up and please subscribe and uh i'll put a link below i do have a patreon as well if you would like to support my work and uh, my fun time here um i appreciate it all right have a great one and be well stay safe Bye bye